Medical Chief of Staff of the Joseph N. Franz General Hospital, Dr. Cameron Wilkinson, encouraged the general public to not be alarmed or panic as the number of positive cases of COVID-19 have risen following the relaxation of entry requirements in December of 2021. The sharp rise in cases in the fourth wave from Omicron is not a surprise to us. With this variant being highly transmittable, this will be the case in any country, but where people remain vulnerable without the protection to vaccination, the results could be deadly. This current situation emphasizes the importance of the non-pharmaceuticals and more so the vaccination. It's our high vaccination rate among our adults that is protecting us. Health officials note that the recovery rate and shortened length of infections are good news as medical personnel relies on best practices and updated guidelines to tackle the spread of the virus. We have learned a lot over the last 18 months. We know that if you are vaccinated and boosted and are wearing an appropriate mask appropriately, one, your risk of getting COVID is very low but that you could have a breakthrough infection. Two, if you do get infected, you are less likely to transmit the virus as you will have a low viral load and be infected for a shorter period of time compared to someone who is unvaccinated. And three, you are most likely to have asymptomatic or mild disease and recover without having to be hospitalized. Statistics from the Ministry of Health reveal that of January 6, 2022, 76% of the adult population have received two doses of a COVID-19 vaccine, while 6.4% have accepted a booster shot. Some 14.4% of children over the age of 12 years are also fully vaccinated. The medical chief of staff encouraged locals to stop focusing on the overall positive numbers, but rather to take comfort in the low hospitalization rate and quality health care being offered. I am Justin Tietishiro for SKN Newsline.